Hi guys, just a quick video to show you flamers and the effect of heat. So as you can see from the first video here, uh, I go into combat with this mech. I fire six flamers, but only three of them hit, causing plus 30 heat damage. Now, even though we're in a desert environment, it's not enough to take it over its f heat threshold. So this was the first time I used them. I was a bit disheartened and I thought, what a waste. They're not worth it. Uh, if you learn to use them correctly though, and you stick with it, they can be a very powerful tool. As you can see here from the second video, I'm in a vacuum environment where heat is much more effective. This is uh, one of the boss fights. I've allowed the boss, I've skipped my turn so that the boss can go first. Initially given my fastest character is uh, equipped with the flamers, two turns. So with his first turn, I hit him with all six flamers, causing 60 heat damage, taking him over his heat threshold causing extra structural damage for that uh, and it's just at the very tip of the top of his of his heat now so uh m the rest of my team gets a turn and then after that my quick mech will have his second turn so as you can see here his second turn comes round um the mech's lost a little bit of heat during that time but i'm going to fire all six at it I, I take off two of my own medium lasers just to make sure i don't overheat here all six flamers get fired at him he takes plus 60 heat damage uh, his heat maximizes and then he goes into shutdown because he's overheated so much which then would give my entire team another free turn while he shuts down to counteract the heat so, as I said, when I first used flamers, I thought they were rubbish. I stopped using them. Uh, I restarted the game. Uh, I gave them a second chance. And as you can see, when they're used properly, they're very effective at taking out larger mechs, stopping them from having their turns, which can be very, very helpful. Hope this helps, guys. Uh, thanks for watching.